Hey, y'all. This is going to be a Libra reading. Then I may get to Taurus, inshallah. Somebody said the divine masculine was coming to get that um, divine feminine. He want to get it out the mud. I said, shit, he want to get her out the mud. Because I know they left some of y'all for dead. For real. Uh, she She's saying it so elegantly. He want to get it out the mud with you. Like, he want to get her out the mud, sis. He left her face down in that shit. She was already a lotus. Ain't that a bitch? Oh, let me say this. If it's any people out there that think, because it could be some divine masculines. This is the same. Some readers just open up channels and you be like, thank you. What kind of shit? I can make this a teachable moment. The divine masculine in this story came to some realization that the sex magic he was doing was detrimental. And he started thinking that he may have been a cause of somebody dying unexpectedly in his family because of the sex magic he was doing. It don't work that way. He was having sex. He was doing sex magic with whoever he was doing with. It's just somebody else doing death spells. Sex magic is sex magic. You hear me? They ain't got nothing to do unless you're into necrophilia or something. You know, but sex magic is trying to produce and manifest money from having sex. It don't have nothing to do with anybody dying. Death spells is what they are. <laughs> Getting insurance policies on people is what they are. You ain't in the bed doing that shit. So that, that don't go together. But some divine masculines probably are. Like, shit. I'm doing all this shit, and that shit to probably kill my cousin. Or some, 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 some. No, that does not go together. It's like jelly on french fries. No. Two separate things. While you was fucking, somebody was doing plotting. <laughs> Got it done. Rio could be a woman being vengeful towards a divine man because he's into sex magic. And, you know, he took control of it. He gonna see who he wants to. He ain't gonna let her pick. If he was in a long-standing commitment, because that's how they do it nowadays. They seek out people like swingers. <clears throat> but if he like shit, I'm going to pick who I want to. I'm going to keep sleeping with this person. I manifest better with this person. Oh, I ain't got control over it no more. Get to get messy. That's why they say you should be careful with opening Pandora's box. And a lot of these women that do this sex magic, if you if they come knocking on your door, tapping on your window pane. If you always going to like three people, it's because that's what they into. <clears throat> well, you're a twin. You can't get away from a twin. The Siamese kind of shit. <clears throat> what they do affects you. But they're so carnal minded when you say that they think you're running some type of game because you want to be the main woman. It is so annoying when they take carnal things and try to compare it to spiritual things or vice versa. You can use metaphors, but it ain't the same thing ultimately. And you're going to think I'm a madman and I'm going to know you one. Because I know what's happening to me because of what you're doing, especially if I'm celibate. If that happens, make the divine masculine your bitch. Ain't nobody in the room but you and him as far as he can serve. Three people. Okay, fine. The bitch don't exist. Or I'll make her you, nigga. And it's just one me. I mean, voila, motherfucker. You can use me. I ain't doing shit. I ain't enjoying shit. The fuck? This work for me. And ain't getting no money. Is y'all ciphering energy and doing it wrong, kind of motherfucker? Some say this sex is overrated, but they just say doing it right. Big up Luda, Virgo energy. It ain't my fault. <laughs> it ain't my fault. And then some of them think the divine masculine, that you're twin, the divine feminine is in separation from the divine masculine. The karmists think that y'all doing something to the divine masculine. 
or them. No, it's your ancestors doing something to the divine masculine and the cards. You ain't doing shit, but minding your fucking business. It's true. It's true. Trying to get out of the mud, you know, like for real. <laughs> I got a call triple. Hey, my shit's stuck. I don't have King Diggle just hanging around unless he wants some energy for his little magic going wrong games. Like for real and cut the boo boo. Y'all ain't doing shit. A lot of their ancestors on their ass. They had a right to be. These are people that helped them in some type of way. And they may have made a pact with them. Told them they was going to be the best self they can be. They going to do it. Da, 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 da. And people calling in the debt. What's that shit you said? What's all that? Yeah, I know you grown. Yada, yada, yada. But what's all that shit you said? Yeah, you may even be older than me. If it's a child checking a father, that's an ancestor. If <laughs> they not here no more. And they connected to you. To pay the pipers. <clears throat> Emperor. They must have been making good ass money. You protecting yourself like a motherfucker, your energy, I bet. All that hard work going up in the smoke and you left in the motherfucking mud. No, move no. Got yourself out of it. And they still following you around, thinking you're doing something. No. Finding my business. Nine of Wands. Stubbornness, rigidity, defensiveness, refusing, compromise, giving up. Yeah. They say some of y'all are stubborn. It's not that. They're immature. <clears throat> How long do you think I'm supposed to keep dealing with that shit? They inconsider it as a motherfucker. They talk about people with unrealistic expectations. Let's talk about unrealistic. What the expectations? You know, it's all about the money for real. And they hung up on you because you're the light bearer for real. Some of their mothers know it. You don't even know their mothers. You didn't get a chance to. Some of y'all wasn't even around that long. And if you was, you know, you was cool with not knowing nobody. You know what I'm saying? They go to barbecues. They go to events or whatever. You may talk to them, but you ultimately end up by yourself at the end of the day. Ain't asking to go no motherfucking where. Don't hate nobody. Okay, have a nice time. Not even tell your mother hi. Hello, somebody. That mean y'all got shit going on in y'all own. You ain't never got to time. Especially if you breathing. And that'd be the worst during the holidays. They don't give a fuck about that. They don't give a fuck. What you ain't doing. This and that. You're stubborn. You're inconsiderate as a motherfucker. Ain't sending you shit. Yeah, taking y'all from the Ten of Pentacles with this magic. That's a phallus. With this fucking magic. This sex magic. So goddamn. Now you gotta pay for their immaturity, foolishness, irresponsibility, underachievers procrastinators, missing chances, poor prospects. And they ain't even got nothing to come back with, but they foul us. And they steadily trying to bind y'all every five minutes and y'all done clearly move the fuck on. That's harassment. Quit following me in Walmart. For real. My divine masculine, his car ain't following me in Walmart. I've been done, I ain't seen this thing in four years. Why are you following me in Walmart? Two dudes I dated. <laughs> like, what? Why are you following me in Walmart? I don't date them no more. What the fuck? For real, y'all. <laughs> I'm trying to, like, and I'm in my car, homeless. Like, these hoes push me out just to be able to come to the Walmart. Like, it's so many people involved in my life, and I have nobody in my life but my cat. Please help me to understand somebody. Day for day, I'm with me. Can't nobody tell me who the fuck I'm talking to? 
when I'm telling you, because I'm with me. I talk to my cat and my ancestors. <clears throat> They got a whole bunch of bitches. It's like every time a new one, they get involved in a new one with this sex magic shit, it goes wrong. But they some reason, they keep thinking they can be Superman and fix it. And they make it worse and worse and worse. In the meantime, in between time, you living your life, they binding you up. You still walking away because you oblivious to the fact that whoever he got, you don't know. However many he got, you don't know. You ain't seen them. But you end up being the target of being trapped and victimized and imprisoned. Yet you've been letting go, been walking away. You know what I'm saying? Been searching for your truth. Been leaving the bullshit behind. As far as any arguments, disputes, may have had one explosion after that done deal. And they can't lay it to rest. Like these motherfuckers ain't got no life whatsoever. When your life get like that, you need to start volunteering some motherfucking way. Because you're going to get in the shit you ain't got no business. For real. <laughs> bitch, make, do something else with your time, bitch. It's always things to master. Outside of a dick. Take a karate class, bitch. Tabo, ho. Whole ass tower. Just keep trying to fix it and fucking up. Some of y'all could be dealing with a Libra, or a Libra could be dealing with a Capricorn. This thing got into some more dumb shit, and now they possessive and keep causing towers, and y'all don't even know them. It ain't even past life. He just keep getting new people to add to, which y'all are oblivious to. Because y'all got to get it out the mud for real. Like, nobody to help you with the groceries. Nobody to get your car washed. Nobody to clean that motherfucker off. Nobody to put gas in it. Nobody to go get you nothing to eat. Nobody nobody to do a motherfucking thing for you. You don't even know. Look how different this shit is. This is what they... This this is pretend they in this. Because the Seven of Swords right there letting you know it's the trickery and lies going on. Look at how different... But for some reason, you just keep being a subject. But they got the Ten of Cups and pregnancy and all this. And money and all of this. And it's connected to y'all divine masculine. Y'all in separation from. I don't even know. Some of y'all may have children with them. It's just messy as fuck. Mm-hmm. Tyrannical, these people. Be careful. For real. Because you don't know who is who. They pull up on me in Walmart, y'all. One by the meat section, one in the bathroom. I laugh at both of them. <laughs> what the fuck you following me for? I had been channeling in my car. I was doing tarot in my car. I was recording it for people that I know watching and then just delete it. He come up on my radar. And another guy that I was dating before him. And they reminded me of each other weird as fuck. Like, what the fuck is y'all wanting and what the fuck is y'all doing here? It was like a dream. I was like, that ain't her. The one that I know what she looked like. I'm like, that ain't her. I'm looking like, is this this bitch? I'm laughing like, hell no, if that's her. I just go about my business trying to figure out what I'm about to eat. And go back to my motherfucking home, which was my Honda Civic. <clears throat> Go in the, to the bathroom, man, in my business, washing my ass in my new bathroom, public bathroom. Excuse me, brushing my teeth like a motherfucker, washing my face, hearing the fuck on, because I ain't going to be stinky and nasty out in this motherfucker. I don't give a fuck. Good morning. Shit. Hello, somebody. She come damn near snatching the motherfucking paper towel rack off the wall. Beautiful girl. I don't want him. And who the fuck is you anyway? I ain't never even seen you, bitch, but I know you was with Stanley. Oh, shit. Then the next thing you know, I'm calling him, going over his house. I ain't seen this nigga in like seven years. He just close to where I live at. He calls me back. We get disconnected. Never to hear from him again. This is a cult shit. I mean, just weird. When you're not doing anything, I do mostly Reiki. 
things dealing with the chakra centers. These motherfuckers be getting into all kind of shit. And because you slept with them, you just get thrusted. Especially with some twin flame shit, you just get thrusted in a motherfucking experience that you're like, oh, what? You know, for real, like the fish in a fishbowl. Like, how did I even get here? Like, who, hey, look, I'm not a fish kind of shit. And you ain't supposed to know. You're supposed to act like you ain't never seen them. Like, what? Planning, first steps, making decisions, leaving comfort, taking risks. Yeah. Show me all that right now. It's because of these hoes. You don't want to let go of whatever, but the divine masculine keeps bringing more and more people to these weird sex parties. Preferably, he don't have HIV, AIDS, or chlamydia, or SCDs, or something. Take them up top. Want to settle down, but too much went on. And I don't know. I don't know. A lot of black women, a lot of black elderly women, they may not even know it, but if you a black elderly woman that got to be by trees, like it's not even an option for you. And when I say elderly, like let's just say 60 and up. You a dark fae. No joke. And give them their trees. Yeah, shit. A lot of people don't know what they are. They just know they need certain shit and they operate a certain type of motherfucking way. Straight up and down. Like, oh, I am? Like, yes, girl. These hoes keep knocking on my light. Can y'all see that? It look kind of smoky. Because my incense was in there, but it's okay. Because y'all can still hear me. And y'all can still see a little bit, but it looks kind of blurry. Because that incense was in there like that. But I would rather, you know, dragon blood than have to deal with a dark dragon bitch flying and flopping all over the place. Mm-hmm. It's some dark white face. It is. Same age group. I'll kill you about the planet. And they got to have no knife. Just sitting there right there in their living room, just like that, holding on to it. They got one, but they just sit there just like that. And it be slaying. Motherfuckers that fuck up the earth and don't give a fuck. Right in their living room, honey. <laughs> Lickety, splickety like a motherfucker. Who come in the upper rest of nobody? They ain't doing nothing. Just holding a sword. Ain't nobody in here with me. The holler kill. For real. Homeless as fuck. Some of y'all too? They push high priests out. They really did. <laughs> and a lot of it is from the I'm asking. It's just too much sex. Eight different partners. And having sex with all of them on a regular basis. Some of these are I'm asking. That's what they get. It's just what the fuck they get. Only a fool, honey. Mm-hmm. Coming with this practical, reliable. Ah, always trying to sell themselves. Like, what the fuck kind of slave shit went on where men were for sale? Always want to get somebody to resume. Why do you really care? Right. Not like you. Mm-hmm. Y'all, I'm telling y'all, they be worried about y'all. And y'all ain't talk to these men? Like, how do they even know I existed? You know, I didn't even think he knew, thought I was, I, I didn't even think he cared that I was alive. I have been in the mud for a minute. You know, like, what? I had to get out that bitch by myself. They celebrate you moving on. From your divine masculine. And he wants you to fight, fight. You're like, what? <laughs> you know where your ass was at. When I was, you know, dead in the mud from your sescapades. From your sexcapades. More dick for us. 
He had eight, now he only has five left. But we are the chosen. Meanwhile. <laughs> You're trying to find a fuck to give before the sun go away for the fall and the winter. You know, back to work, back to life, back to reality. Brought to the here and now real. Some of them got two more. Woo. And it fucks with my shit. My YouTube like they crazy. Some of y'all's too. It's all Carmishas. All Carmishas and deadbeats. 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 And the male karmics go within the Carmishas too. You stay a bitch. You know, because they love to say they're taking care of it. They got all the money and this and that. You go with the Carmishas, nigga. It don't matter what money you pay. You still a bitch. You know, y'all the broth said they're coming after the twin flame like crazy. This is the energy of the dark Jewish God, Yahweh. Y'all the broth. It's true. I'm going to keep saying it because he keeps wanting me to being funny. Get away from heartbreak. Get away from heartbreak of any kind, but they do target fucking twin flames like crazy. Like it's, 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 it's insane. Like somebody called the National Guards. I heard Gulf War. So this is a spiritual Gulf War. Now I gotta research the fucking Gulf War. God damn. <sighs> Get away from it. Clearly. I mean, driving, pole jumping. Let's see what else. If there's any more movement, they're really me. Get the fuck out. King of Pentacles. Somebody ain't going nowhere. They vested. Who? I do not know. But they, they will not be moved. I don't know if it's people that know that y'all been slandered to holy hell. And they want to invest in you. And they don't give a fuck what nobody say. They said what they said. They like you. They know these is liars. Blase, blase. It would kind of be like people that's vested in Trump. Like a Trump supporter feel. No matter what people see it, they still going to, you know, rap with them. So y'all just got supporters out there like that, which is dope. Dope as fuck, actually. Which is a beautiful thing. But get away from any dumb shit so that you don't lose momentum on that shit. Because, honey, baby. We in a fucking spiritual Gulf War. What the fuck? 2310 on the clock. Under divine judgment for what they did to twin flame millions, a lot of these queen of wine energies. Just causing heartbreak for nothing. So says Queen of Cups and Queen of Swords ancestors who remain single because of this kind of shit. For real, who want to see you get your victory? Because they didn't. That's a whole nother layer. Outside of the divine masculine and the karmics that he fuck with being whooped on by his ancestors. <laughs> the Gulf War. What the fuck? Oh, hell no. I just keep seeing the Gulf gas station um, symbol. They about to start fucking with gas by then. Oh, God. We're going to be up at $4. What are they trying to do? Give us a ballpark. I see bikes. I see bikes. People getting their bikes out. Right. Eight dollars? They got up there. Okay, we're gonna see y'all. Cause honey baby. They're gonna see it ain't them. Seven dollars. I know you are. Gonna have to be slow everywhere you go. Like for real. Cause if this shit go to seven, eight dollars, y'all, I'm gonna be like, God damn, is you serious? Because California was there. They was. Look that shit up. For real. They're going to act like they don't know nothing. 
As soon as I see it, remind me of that. I mean, they could be gasoline, pouring it up, pouring it up in a metaphoric kind of way. Some of these, oh my God, what? Some of the divine masculines is so terrible and they know it. They is some self-pity shit because it's so much magic that went fucking wrong. That Pandora's box fucked up so much shit in so many people's lives and then hurl people into so many other weird dynamics like the karmics are now gay. Like they decided to be with each other, some of them. So like I said, let's say he lost three, two of those just together now. Two snakes. We'll be in the AKAs. You see that pink and green snakes? You see that? Just the whole ass. And people, the ones that's doing it, oh, acting oblivious. Acting oblivious, they never heard such a thing. Oh, it's a bunch of malarkey. Blah, 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 blah. People know the truth. And only the truth going to set them free from these burdens, right? Some of y'all sitting there with y'all coin, whatever little money y'all get, honey. Still living life being as normal as you can possibly be. Still being charitable where you can. I'm telling y'all, on a total different paradigm. But y'all just end up... It's like y'all can't go nowhere. It's going to be something connected to something. And you be minding your business, thinking you're getting a victory that day. Then all of a sudden, you go back to this. Because you smell some bullshit with the moon girls. You know... Try to go normal, and here comes retraction. You're like, what the fuck? Fuck it then. I'll just go, you know, maybe I should just live in the fucking woods and get a bike. Kind of shit. So I won't get into a deal. They'll give me a bike accident. These hoes. And stay working together. I'm telling you, some of them now live together. A family divine masculine put together by mistake. And by accident, on purpose. You can see how people would think that a death spell got something to do with sex magic. Libra, Libra, Libra. Y'all know y'all like to get the scoop, even if y'all ain't in the story. <laughs> Because it is relevant to you. Shit, you know who the fuck you gonna be, you know. People losing their motherfucking marbles because of this shit. Gulf War? Shit. I mean, I bet your ass wanna know about gas prices no matter what city in there. They don't know if they mad. It's like they won't fall. They like female Goliaths that won't fall. For real. Ooh, somebody just fell. Somebody just fell. Oh, the answers is hot, man. What the blood clot? What the heck, a blood clot? What the blood clot? She got some miscarriages, some babies want retribution. Oh, you killed me. I want to come now. I'm saying, answers will be kicking ass, heavy weights, because they didn't get to get here. They knew what they was going to be doing. They mission, everything. And it was a, what you mean, failed mission? What the fuck you mean? Oh, man. Oof. Go for it. I can't wait to get off of here and see what the fuck that was about. Shit. The spiritual metaphor is going to be crazy. Justice, Libra. Ooh. Six of Swords moving away. By themselves. Don't know what the fuck didn't happen with this fucking magic. They thought they had it. I almost had it. I was going slow and steady, and then the next thing you know, I'm to the nine of wands. Mm -mm. Step up in that motherfucker just to swing in my hair. <laughs> Ooh, Lord, honey. Ooh, wee. Somebody getting them, them asses together. A father figure. Big daddy. 
getting little man man together. Got him looking like Uncle Jimmy and Drugs. At least it's talking about show enough. Show enough. Set shit on fire. For real. You out here making me look bad? Really? That's what we doing? Okay, go. For pure for D I swoopy. D I swoopy. They cut my video off on El Coolio. Moody yo, we cool yo. The type of girl that slap you with the tool, yo. Trying to fuck with somebody's mental stamina. Like, what? I just don't understand. Some motherfuckers will go Batman. You know, like, give me some downtime, bitch. Thank you. For real. Black people be working, some black people that work, they understand what the fuck I'm saying? Black people that work, they understand what the fuck I'm saying? Getting sick sometimes, you be like, ooh, get some sleep. They don't feel the best, but God damn. Ooh, at least for real, when I get to worry about the job calling me, ooh. Weak, egoism, abuse of power, aggression, imbalance, giving up, manipulation, strong arming, misuse of power. <sighs> misuse and abuse, damn. Unrealistic expectations, faithless, impatient. Remain aware of your own weaknesses so that you're not prone to be manipulated by others. Undisciplined, powerless, domineering personality. Yeah, just a prince of wine, goofy ass, slanging it everywhere, not understanding his value, but taught his value. And in order to get, I'm telling you, I feel like a best friend of mine, she told me this. I think I remember her telling me this, but she had gotten witchcraft in more than likely, but she came from good ass stock, a two-parent household. You know what I'm saying? It's a difference when you came from a two-parent household and your parents, sometimes in a black world, white people and other races, just so you understand my people a little bit better and quit looking at us fucking crazy. In our world, it's like, just give me a minute, because I'm going to get, they trying to take it, because they just, this is what they do. They weird as fuck, bro. <laughs> for real. For real, for real. If you come from a two-parent household where it's a lot of children, th those type of divine masculines, they're going to end up selling dope, because they ain't about to be poor like that. And they could come from church parents. They could come from politicians. They could come from whatever the fuck. They're going to get into something. Slinging bootlegs. Doing something to make their own motherfucking income. And it ain't going to be legal. You know what I'm saying? It's just the way it is. Now, it's different from somebody who has the perfect life. Where perfect in terms of, I want this, this, and this, and get it. A house, a dog, and 1.5 children. A house, a dog, and 2.5 children. They get that, and then it's just... The children just go off. The ones that's giving me heart pains right now. They don't like to be looked at as wanksters, but they don't understand that it. it's different levels to this shit in the black community and in the black world. And you need to understand that shit. You don't get a pass, my nigga. You chose to sell drugs and do all this shit. Niggas that literally parents had 10 children and they chose to do it the right way. They ain't doing it the drug way. They ain't doing it. They doing what God said do or... They like that, but they may be factory workers. They This is what they're doing. They're not getting involved in no goddamn drug trade, okay? You should be scarce as fuck when you go, I got a whole bunch of mouths to feed. You work your way up, especially if they're a twin flame type of married couple or whatever. Motherfuckers get lost. <laughs> what is that many people? And the mother is the one that take care of them and the father work? Honey, baby. Good luck if you come out with three that didn't go to prison kind of shit. In America, they hungry, okay? Fuck the bullshit. Meanwhile, leave it to Beaver to get the low-key Huxtable shit jumping off. Decides, fuck you, fuck school, fuck college. I'm dropping out. Not to become a Mark Zuckerberg, no. To become a fucking bum in front of a store soliciting people for a cigarette so they can buy a Lucy. This is facts. 
So you see why some black people be looking at other black people like, who the fuck you looking at, bitch? Who the fuck you looking at? But then when white people come along, they both say, what the fuck you looking at? Strange. I know. I got a doctorate in this shit, man. It's true. You a nigga. No matter what, how much money you make. Real niggas understand that. That's why Uncle Muhammad Ali told Minister Farrakhan, still a nigga, brother. Don't say that, brother. Who made the Wheaties box and I'm still a nigga, brother. See? Ain't nobody disillusioned, but people that don't know what the fuck is going on. She came out again, because she came out, that's it, she came out again. Honey, Leo, honey, listen. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it, sweetheart. You didn't know my people. Kind of shit. Auntie free to talk about my Anita. And some of them are Uchi Chaga Leo with it. Just determined. Do you know how irritating Trika? Man. How irritating he is and how irritating she be. He know where the fuck this is. Where the fuck is it? The blessings is down here. Ancestors got them. You're not getting shit. Like I said, I had a best friend go back there. That mother, she came from good stock. And she didn't go the wrong way. She was a fucking honor roll student that still did what she did, but she kept her motherfucking education in line. Of course, some jealous shit, envious shit, don't even know. She ended up smoking motherfucking embalming fluid. Losing her motherfucking marbles. I can't remember if she told me this, her mother told me this, but once she passed away, I did her mother hair in a casket. That's how much this was my nigga, nigga. Via her father's request for real. That was a whole twin flame. Oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, man, oh, man homie. <laughs> oh my goodness like god damn I mean when you really do the work people benefit if they fuck with you the right way they really benefit but some gonna come up I would've, whatever was in your subconscious mind that's the shit you got to deal with for real that shit crazy as fuck but anyway she couldn't get no money until she got on the right foot. She got on the right foot. She couldn't get her insurance money until she got on the right foot. I think it's better to set it up that way than end up a motherfucker swindling you and take all this old weird ass shit. Children don't get shit. Like, they can get it predicated on this. In my mother's case, they dogged her. I mean, mango. I mean, damn, bitch. <laughs> and took her money and ran. And told her kids, fuck you. And literally sent us text messages of the casket. How she was going to be. This is what it's going to be. You don't have no choices. I'm over this now. Because I've been taking care of her this whole time. You haven't did. This is a lie this bitch told herself. Man, you she come infiltrating our life when I'm nine years old. And my sister about 14 or some shit. Bitch, and I'm looking like this, and my sister looking like Usher, because she an Aries, and she way more bubbly or pleasant than me. Bitch, what? <laughs> you took over, bitch. And my mother grown, ho. This devils infiltrate your life and turn your shit inside out. For real. Been on trash. You gotta watch a motherfucker that can't handle you cussing. A lot of times cussing repels the right people. And you'll know something is wrong with them because it's just words. You can cuss, and what you're saying has absolutely nothing to do with them. They never engaged in drugs, nothing. Lived a pristine life, but the sound of cussing 
does something to them and it's just so and then they're gonna deal with it. But take your self righteous hypocritical ass and get the fuck on. Is that clear enough for you, bitch? Cussing. Like, get the message, bitch. Read all in between the lines, honey. <laughs> yeah, Lisa was Usher and I was Jimmy the whole time. You thought it was the opposite. No. Right. Meanwhile. Meanwhile, stepped on the wrong shoes, bitch. Like some of y'all, these weird motherfuckers just infiltrating y'all life. I ain't lying. Some of y'all need to get reflective. I ain't lying. Got a little dimmer outside because some of y'all really do need to get reflective. For real. Motherfucking hoes just knocking a nigga light out. I mean... And it'll just kick back on. This is how you know. They stay working with their tired ass. Damn, bitch. Somebody break these hoes' fingers already. Like, for real. Because it seems like the only thing that will fucking work taking Middle Eastern around this bitch. These is investigators, as they should. They ain't thinking about me cussing and getting the information and getting that shit right like a motherfucker. With me saying all of that. They ain't stupid like these hoes. Five of Pentacles, uh, nephew showing you motherfuckers. Silly as fuck. Why he ain't here no more? Why a whole bunch of people ain't here no more because of these stupid ass hoes? Can't you see? <laughs> Do you listen to Jay-Z? God. I should have knew that mother was a Virgo nigga. That shit just blew my mind. The hermit. Honey, baby. They better go. I cannot wait. All oh, them niggas, Jay, just sand off at the Million Man March. Oof. Oof. What's this archive? Just wait on it. The hammer. Oh, you want to keep embarrassing me? Oh, you think I'm a preacher? Oh, you think this is a joke? Oh, I sat out here all that time and talked to you? He like to take it a grandfather on these niggas. Because ain't nobody told you to come. You came in droves. I made the call. The final one. How many years ago, minister, was two million men on the wall? Signing up, signing on the dotted line. They commit to their communities to take charge of their communities. And blase, blase, blase. And niggas, uh, uh, my grass is fucked up outside. And this ain't even my house kind of shit. You said, wait. You already know they started to look. You know it, Jay. You know it, B. Come on, look at that shit. Just like it was freak me. You know that shit. Oh, Tupac. Oh. <laughs> Shame on them. Shame on them, bitch. Shame on them. And meanwhile, real niggas that was committed to it signed off and knew exactly what was going on. They sitting up being attacked by these weird ass hangman, foolish ass motherfuckers. Honey, baby, and I ain't talking Andre 3000. He see 3000 years into the future, motherfucker. Don't you know what the fuck you think he playing a flute flow? I said, fuck it. Listen here. Just waiting for the bottom to fall out like Uncle Bob Bear had said. Now you got uh, <laughs> people ready to take it back to unstatus two of wands. Fuck all this shit, nigga. Let's take it back to the crush groove days. Anyway, kind of shit. Because these are the ones that put in the work. But steadily under attack by their own. And white people that don't be knowing what the fuck is going on. But how the fuck can you sit up explain all of this? Reason Uncle Donny Hathaway was like, man, fuck this shit. These motherfuckers in my headphones, nigga. He crazy. No the fuck he ain't. He said the FBI, the CIA, when it was karmics kind of shit. The only thing that made him look crazy is that he was saying the FBI and the CIA made him kill his motherfucking self. He just went with it. I'm trying to tell you, these hoes is grimy for a long time. 
I don't give a fuck. I'm gonna talk how I talk, bitch. Pull up, nigga or bra. I don't give a fuck. I got a death wish like yo ass. Ben had hang man and hang woman. Lazarus and Lazarina. Don't sign me up on the row ass nigga. This ain't no slave shit, motherfucker. We was on the mall in Washington, bitch. Funky dog. For real. <laughs> Come on, honey. Boogie Doll Productions will always get paid. And so will she, kind of shit. You ain't stopping nothing. What the fuck is born for this shit, bitch? For real. I see the, the white boy that's on 50 Cent Show Power. That nigga is born for that shit. Just like the Law and Order dude. I seen him in person. That's how I know. I can look at somebody and tell if they got makeup on and shit like that. He wear makeup, but he looks fake because he was really born to be an actor. Like if he didn't put on no makeup, nothing, he would still look like like he preserved this some shit. I don't know. It's really weird. The dude on Law and Order, I seen him in New York. He looked like he should be put in a dial box. For real. The one with the, like, he may be bald a little bit. Excuse me. The her main partner. Him. He had like a leather jacket. Like, like I wanted to put, I'm like, look at him. Like, he was born to be an actor. No fucking doubt. When a motherfucker know what the fuck they was born to do, what the fuck you think you got to tell them? They wasn't, and you got to play with their life and tell them to go get a job at motherfucking Chipotle. Like, like you got to be out your fucking mind. For real. People be born for certain shit. They ain't got time to be playing with your fucking tower accident going somewhere to happen to hit ass. Man, move, bitch. Kind of shit. For real. Killing real motherfuckers and Muslims at that. We have been past 10,000, man. For real. Grace and mercy. Seems to profit you nothing. Jeez. Is that right? Is that right, Jay? <laughs> we was at seven just waiting to get to ten kind of shit of important Negroes that died <laughs> untimely. What the fuck, man? Come on, man. Ooh, we this ain't a Libra reading. I don't know what he is, honey. Right, why is you worried about who Lil Wayne tools and if Toya ain't? She got her twin flame and he got his. What the fuck? Sometimes people get lucky because they got a shitty ass hand in the first place. Didn't he get shot and shit? Somebody had to save him before he died and have the death? That's terrible. That really still fucks with him. Wouldn't it fuck with you, bitch? It ain't never happened to you, so how do you know? Ask some motherfucker that got shot with a gun whatever time, bitch. They almost lost their, like, gurgling blood and shit. Bitch, see if you won't relive that shit like a goddamn Gulf War veteran. And worried about who he laying with. Don't worry about it. You wasn't interested. You said he was this and that, this and that. Go on to God, like, bitch. You know? The fuck? She a big girl. So What? That's his business. Toy ain't saying shit. She trying to figure out what she gonna do with this Tupac nigga she got. Or a lucky Luciano kind of shit. <laughs> Don't wait till my aunt, you know. Good luck to y'all though. Here go again. <laughs> Hell to the north. <laughs> <laughs> Cole, J. Cole already fell. Represent Glow, <laughs> the ladies of Glow. <laughs> I want to be a part of it. I'm a Virgo. Okay, shit. <laughs> Somebody, y'all about to get into some gangster shit. Ooh, wee. Oh, we, baby. I'm trying to tell you. Magic kill all of them. Not all of them tried. Just to take off. Magic, bitch. This is real. This is not mumbo jumbo. Listen to some fucking reggae music. Bougie Bonta. I mean, pick one. Beanie, man. Pick one. Shaka Zulu. <laughs> Shaka Ranks, nigga. Pick one. 
I mean, you don't have to just listen to Uncle Bob. He been hollering, hollering. But they be hollering, hollering too. To all the ghetto youth. And still, it's real. And still, what? Some people just ain't going for the boo boo, okay? <laughs> Burn the house down, bitch. But hey, when you get out, meet me. Bring a box of L's, you know? For real. Say what you want to. For real. People sick of the boo boo. All these night of wines, page of wines, silly ass shit. They being clawed to the carpet by Minister Farrakhan, who probably somewhere looking like Uncle Quincy Jones, okay? But what is y'all even doing? I thought I told you. Let me that switch off that tree. For real. For real, like... <laughs> I mean, so much, so many volumes and volumes and volumes and volumes of teaching men and women marital navigational tools. There's nothing that you could say. Nothing. And it's right at your fingertips. And motherfuckers still got to cover up their crowns and shit. While you silly popping pussies and all this shit. With the same niggas that signed off on the two man you made one. Oh. Two million men march, yeah. We had a nice turnout at the family march, and I was there. I couldn't go to the million men march, it was just for so called men. The fuck? Yeah, here, whole security. Where was you at? Shit, I ain't talking to Beyonce. For real. Shit ain't no hoe. You gotta be carried downstairs the next days and shit. Meanwhile, niggas still lying, still in your face talking about shit you ain't never heard of. Get the fuck away from me, still holding on. Don't understand at all. Motherfuckers coming up dead in the doorknob, still on the bullshit. Still looking at you stupid like they ain't black. I mean, goddamn. Gotta keep pulling this deck out. Just to keep showing how many dead bodies is around here. How many people got the gift to channel and you're not fucking schizophrenic. How many people have the right to change their lives or to be with a different race because it is their twin flame. Or if they did some shit in their childhood, it's their fucking business. They learn convictions. And mind your fucking business. Kind of shit. And where's Michael Jackson? Shh. This shit dead as fuck. It really is. Nikki, you already know it's dead. Come on. What the fuck is she supposed to be with? Mick Mills or the baby's daddy? Give us a break and quit playing these old whole ass games. She was the happiest that she ever was. And he was the happiest that they ever was. And nobody could fuck with them. And it went together. And it wasn't weird. It was just what it was. Oh, oh Nikki and me. Ain't shit to it. Don't ask me about no Nikki. I ain't coming on no Wendy to tell my motherfucking business, bitch. Nigga, this Jasmine Sullivan off this motherfucker. And they kill her mom. And she still, she, her and my life look alike, like a motherfucker. Like, is we cousins kind of shit? For real. I just don't go to the extreme she do. But I feel her because she's younger than me. And if I was her age, more than likely, a nigga, car windows would be bust the fuck out. I used to be singing that shit to the top of my lungs, but would not dare. But I felt her, though. <laughs> For real. Like, what? Quit playing with me, boy. That's why y'all here around here. Y'all ain't no good chance. Don't shit be shaking around here. I just flushed the Black Widow down the sink. Like, what are you even doing here? You know, especially when you don't see them and they're big and he was just like the picture I just posted with the bulb on the motherfucker. Like, what? <laughs> Recluse, okay, but 
Where the fuck you come from? Shh. Drain. Mm, mm, mm. Be careful out here because some can get you. <laughs> I'm just telling you. And ancestors ain't playing no kind of games with nobody. You, if you think they playing tread light because they might knock the life out your motherfucking way. Especially if you a karmic coming after their legacies and the shit that they laid down prior to being taken out prematurely. Love and light, Libra.